up, you guys? I'm DeAndre. I'm Javante. And this is Dre and Jay. And today, we're going to be checking out the trailer for HBO Max's new House of the Dragon uh, series based on the Game of Thrones uh, TV series. Uh, Game of Thrones. Great show. Terrible ending. It rubbed me off the wrong way, so I'm hoping by watching this trailer, it kind of gives me something to look forward to within the Game of Thrones franchise or, you know, movie series. Um... So with that, I mean, you got anything to say? No? Just want to watch it? Let's check it out? Alright, let's go ahead. <sighs> Turn the subtitle off. God damn, is that going to bother you that damn much? Yes, I don't want to see them. I made this here. Dreams didn't make us kings. Dragons did. Twenty twenty two. Oh, you know. Okay, Game of Thrones. You know what? After losing me with that god awful season eight, you guys might have just brought me back just by this trailer. Cause this looks really good. I'm ah, uh, <laughs> I mean, shit. The House of Dragons, dude. Like the House of the Dragon. I'm excited to see how the fall of the Targaryens began with this series. Um, damn, man. This looks awesome. This this is a good start for me. This based is based on a book, huh? It's based on a book. I actually need to look that up. I don't, I'm not sure. I I mean I hope it is. I hope it's not. Then I'm not with it. Yeah, if they if they just trying to wing it because that's basically what they did with the last season. Yeah, you know I'm saying. So I'm not sure. But y'all, if it's based around a book, I mean I don't know, man. Game of Thrones kind of lost. But, te- but technically, this takes place before all uh, like you know Game of Thrones. So I'm guessing they at least a lot of the stuff is kind of. Um, I don't think you would need a book. Is there a book out that? Towards this, you're doing a prequel to that stuff that began. I don't, I don't know. Or you would, you would need his input, the, the writer's yeah, input. I'm, I'm not sure, but, this. but I mean, there's always they've always talked about like, you know, House Targaryen. No, and I know how they the talk, history. Yeah, of it, I, so. I know that. But I'm saying, did he ever write a story to that before? Yeah, you know I mean, well, like if they're they're taking it where there's like, oh, we're gonna wing it, we're gonna create some stuff that maybe he like you know what I mean? I'm just asking is he is he having a say on like you mean George R. R. Mark yeah is he having a say on this on this I don't even think he probably have a say on this low key let's be honest Should I hope he does if he's not having a say then I don't I just don't think I think it's more of a money grab than anything just cause the name Game of Thrones is gonna sell let's see it is a pre-consumed. oh it is based on Martin's 2018 novel Fire and Blood yep okay sold hmm I'll check it out but I don't know if I'm sold yet they they fell the back with the last one. What are you talking about? House with the Game of Thrones the original series. Mm-hmm. They fell the back with that last season, bro. That still still got me hot. Yeah, but George R. R. Martin wasn't even finished making this uh, re- writing the fucking book. Okay, so let's be okay. So that's true. They're gonna try to push this though for multiple seasons. This ain't gonna be just one season and done. Oh, I understand. Know what I mean, you know, we just they gonna mention around material. They're gonna be like, oh, we gotta stretch it. They gonna have to do that kind of shit. Yeah. Who's uh who's directing? Who's who's uh Damn, producing want, stuff? Let me look at all this shit up. I'm just saying, it's the old boy that did the last. That did the. This is the old boys that did the last. D D M D and D. Yeah, some of those. The those guys had no creativity. Those guys were the, the, the dude. There were other dudes that were really doing that. They were. They were just. There's no way they were doing them first couple seasons, and they came with that game of, that last season. Created by Ryan J. Connell, George R. R. Martin. Uh, let's see. Production. I think for me, I, I'll check it out for sure. I'm gonna look at it as a. Uh, but I got on Game of Thrones late. Like, I wasn't on. I didn't get. I didn't really start watching until literally right before. Uh, I started watching right after the second and final season. I saw. I, I heard. You know, I was always. I heard the hype around it. But I was like, eh, I'll check it out. I'll check it out. 
But I ended up watching it, caught all the way up and stuff like that. Got real into it. I was like, okay, this is cool. It's tight. And that last is really disappointing. I know there's people out there that probably had it worse than me because I was able to binge it most of it. I know people had to wait, see, you know, after certain cliffhangers, had to wait the whole, like, couple months to the next season or a whole year to the next season drop. So I know for them to get that last season and they done invested more time. I mean, that was hot. So hopefully they do right by the fans and they, um, you know, I hope it's good. I hope, I hope it is good. I think, it'll be, I think the first. I know they're trying to spin it off to do multiple seasons, but let's see if this first year might be good. I mean, again, hey, eight foot match, I do like they're trying to keep subscribers, so yeah, gotta keep putting out content. So I think it'd be alright. Well, I'm gonna say it's from a first I'm trailer and what they showed in the trailer. It looks solid. It looks it looks like it's um, it kind of fit fits that same theme of Game of Thrones, like a lot of the same stuff and same same things that you see visually from Game of Thrones are in this trailer. Yeah. Um. So it definitely fits within Game of Thrones. Yeah, it'd be interesting to watch. It'd be interesting. I'm sure it'll be. I'm sure I'll have some people in here that'll make their name and become big time actors, actors and actresses. Oh yeah, like just like Game of Thrones. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, you know, shout out to it. let's get let's give it a shot. Let's check it out. For yeah, sure. So. For sure. Yeah, I'm this is definitely it. one that I will be watching the first day it comes out. For sure. Yeah. But um, what did you guys think of the House of Dragon, House of the Dragon, uh, prequel series for Game of Thrones? Uh, let us know down below in the comment sections below. I don't, I don't like them Targaryens though. Huh? I don't really fuck them Targaryens like that. Oh yeah, nobody really does. But hey, I mean they are. They do. They have the most interesting animal dog. They have the dragons. Nah, they are. Right. I'm not. Do really you really want? Do you, do you thought we want to listen to a fucking Stark fan? Well, they don't even. They didn't even have wolves like that. Them Starks are whack too. They huh? You heard me. Starks are whack also. Call what it is. So who? So who's real? The Lannisters? Yeah. Oh, okay. Because they keep it a buck what, what it is. Like, you know what time it is. Yeah. If you think it's okay to have fucking yo sister. No, I'm not saying right? all that, but they do take care of business when they be taken care of. Oh, for sure. The Starks, right. hey, look, I'll say it to this day. I'll be telling everybody. The, the, Snow, the Lancers Josh motto Snow. has been fuck everybody else. It's uh, it, it's us against the world. Fuck but, everyone else. Yeah, for facts. Look at the Starks, bro. They get ran through. The only way it has some, the only way you can give some credit to is Arya. The rest of them, let's be honest. Yeah. Trash. Even though Rob Stark's one of my He's trash. Stop, stop. He's trash. We're not going there. He got trash? We're not going there. And anyway. man, Louie could have had his woman. Uh, he could have kept her on the low low and married that chick for that dude. Yeah. But he, he he got his mom killed, got his wife killed, got everybody killed because he wanted to follow the girl he loved. Okay. And he did. Okay. And well, got his mom killed. We ain't going to talk about no Rob Stark. Wasn't that no, good? No Rob Stark slander in this house. It's the facts. I'm keeping it real. I, like, Rob Stark was tight till he did that. Yeah. Yeah, you know I mean, I'm just calling it what it is. And Jon Snow, man, that man whack as hell. I don't know why people like Jon Snow. Oh my god. Jon Snow don't do shit. Jon Snow ain't got no victory. What victory Jon Snow got? Who he defeat? Wildlings. He teamed up with them fools. He didn't defeat them. No, he, he defeated them. them the first time. And they became friends. Yeah, but I'm saying he defeated them the first time. Okay, yeah. When what about they, his? What about the wall? What about the major? The major victories. He ain't got no major victories. Like, when he was trying to handle business, he handled business. Hey, you know what? Hey, let me ask you. I don't. I don't give a fuck. Jon Snow, real, just oh, for that scene alone oh, in Battle of the Bastards, when that nigga had all them niggas charging at him, he just pulled out that sword and said, "He's about to get by to the sister okay, king." Don't matter. Hey, here. Let me say hey, this. he would have went out like a real nigga. Let me say this right here, Jon Snow. Right? You like Jon Snow, right? Yeah. Jon, well, that's not fair. I was gonna say. So you look at you. No, no, hold on. I gotta say, Jon Snow. I like Jon. I like Jon Snow for who he is. But as far as major victories, he has none. Every battle that he's supposed to take care of and handle business. You, like, let me ask you this: When you watched that show, you thought who's who's gonna kill the the the, the king? Jon Snow. Yeah. Okay. They kill him. That's on the writers, nigga. They were. I'm saying Jon Snow's whack. That's on the writers. They should have had no what the writers should have done. Already got all the season eight. Bro. That's what I'm saying. In season eight, they should have gave Jon Snow his final, his first actual major victory. Then they sent him against like, the Night King. Or look, some bro. Shit. Arya got the victory against the revenge to revenge your boy Rob. She got that victory. She got the victory to kill the the, the king Night King. She got all the victories. Yeah. Then they sent Jon Snow back with the Wildlings. He okay. can't even stay in the damn world. I'm not. I'm not saying Jon Snow. Wasn't treated like shit, especially with He's the last, trash character. last season. I mean, no, he had solid character development and up until the last season. He was good. Not really. He, no, no, no. Yes, yes, he did. Yes, he, he was did. still taking L's. Nigga, no, no, because he was the one who united the the Night's Watch with the Wildlings. He was the one who died for doing that, came back to life, and he had the most badass quote where he was like, my watch has ended because technically he died, so he could leave. That's the fine. Watch. Yeah, that's fine. And then, better. and then he for he tries to rally as many Northerners as he can because you know because of Rob's actions, they they're not really supportive of any Stark family, and rallies as much as he could to go up against an army that he knows has about 
three times as much as they do. Still does it anyway. Cause he why? Because he wants the North back. He wants to reclaim the North. I fuck with that. No bullshit. Anyway, but yeah, he does all that. Then you find out, oh, this man is actual royalty. Like he's he, he is no goddamn royalty. Yes, he is. He is the um, let's go. Yeah, he's royalty by yeah technically. Yeah, by blood he's a Targaryen. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, fine. But what he's, heir, he's heir to hey, the Iron Throne. They showed him no no royalty. When he, yeah, uh, but, got his ass kicked to the guy. But, that, but that's what I'm saying. The season eight ruined that. That's what I'm saying. So I'm saying like that kid was trash. No, no. He's not, but what you're saying is he's always been trash. He's was he trash. Has. No, he's had his moments. He's always been. Bro, a when it came into the big moments where he's like, oh, we got a big baddie in the way, he never handles the business. Okay. His sister had to take care of him. Arya had to take care of him. Where are his victories at? Give me one victory. He had to- no, I'm technically him and, uh, what's his name? S- uh, Sonya. No, 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 yes, no. Yes, yes. He was going to die, bro. They, but, but I'm saying that victory counts for both of them. No, nigga. Yes, because it does. He was getting, his people were dying. They, 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 he was getting buried in the fucking thing. He was going to die until she pulled up with the army. Okay, don't matter. He still, okay, he still yeah. played a part. Here, quick question. Lord of the Rings, right? At the end. Oh, no, who, who was the one that fucking knocked out Ramsey? Oh, my He goodness. stormed in, had that shield, yes. knocked his ass out. Cool, but he doesn't get there without her. I nigga, that's what I'm trying to say. But it was a it was a split victory. They both no, she gets the they both that. contributed to the victory. She gets the she, he might get that little small part. She gets the main majority of that victory. Nigga, I'm tired. It's like with Lord of the Rings. I'm, I'm tired. Lord of the Rings. I'm tired. Oh, I'm tired of you. Two, no, 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 Lord of the Rings two you, towers. Just, just oh look, Lord of the Rings two towers. Who gets the victory when they when old boy? Who who came and said the day? But Gandalf. they still played a part, nigga. You gotta hold them niggas off at one. But point. if it weren't for the, if it weren't for Gandalf, what happened? If Gandalf, if Gandalf really was the hero, he would have showed up right on the spot. He had to get the goddamn people. Nope, he would have showed up right on the spot. Hey, your army. Nope. What are you talking that's about? On, well, that's on him. He showed showed up right on the See, spot. That's what happened. He 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 loses his army, and then he wants to try to use all this other shit. Nah, but you over here. I'm saying you give Jon Snow. I'll give Jon. Look, Jon Snow can get a little credit. What I'm saying is Jon Snow would have died without her. Yes, nigga. Of course. But still, Jon Snow, that victory is Jon Snow's too. But that's just, if Jon Snow, if Arya could low-key kill Ramsay with the with the army she had, after they had busted through that bitch, she could have killed Ramsay. Yes. So does she really need Jon Snow for that? You mean Sonya. Sonya. Yeah, Sonya, my bad. Mm-hmm, yeah. Does she really need Jon Snow at the end of the day? Because she had the oh, army. Sansa. What the fuck am I? I'm Sansa, Sansa, yeah, you tripping yeah, Sansa. Sansa. Sorry, man. So, so does she have, to, so what's up? <sighs> huh? Speaking truth. Johnson has trashed me, but everyone yeah, has their opinion like we like. You are, yeah, you, are yeah, asked, you are asked for that fucking statement. Anyway, yeah, cut me off. This video there. was supposed to end ten minutes ago. You no, over here kept it stalled because you want to like trash Jon Snow. Like you want to keep, keep trashing Jon Snow, and you I like the and you, and you like the Lannister nigga. So uh, stop. Anyway, I'm saying that I respect them for who they are. Uh, they are who they are. Okay. Actually, like I like old girls family the best probably. Nigga, can we? Can we? No, I like them. What's the people? The one with the 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 three sisters. The Sam. Yeah. They were cool. I mm-hmm. like them. Didn't uh, didn't her husband get killed for showboating? No, no, no. Yeah, well, that so, was. So does it? Does his victory? Does he count as a as a good character? Did he have a, a good victory? No, 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 no. Fuck no. He he take his L too. Yeah, anyway. but I'm talking about the people. So he's a, so he's a trash character. Yeah, I get that. Okay, all right. Just In their country good. though, they were lit. In his country, D- didn't they get killed off too? That because they got sneaked upon, bro. They weren't respecting that shit. Mm. Okay. Yeah. I can't believe we kept saying Sansa. It's Sansa. Anyway, um, yeah, let us know down below in the comment section your thoughts on House of the Dragon if you're excited for it. Um, do you still have kind of mixed feelings going into it with how season eight of Game of Thrones went? Um, but yeah, let us know down below in the comment section. If you like this reaction, be sure to leave us a like, subscribe, and be sure to tune in for more. All right, you guys, that'll be all. Deuces. Take care, guys.